Sunday night football. We got a good one. It's the Seahawks who are just absolutely flying high and kicking butt. The Rams, they bounce back with a great win last week. They're favored by one point over under at 46 and a half. And the Seahawks have won four straight against the spread, Mike, if that means anything to you. Do you think the Rams can pull off an upset at home in this one? It's not an upset. They're the favorite. I mean, yeah, but uh, yeah, actually, you're right. I'm, I'm shocked by that. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, uh, look, I, and, it, and it may be uh, not a home game for the Rams. I, I said earlier today on PFT Live that after the Rams got shredded by the Ravens two Mondays ago, a lot of Rams fans may have put their tickets online for sale to Seahawks fans. Seahawks fans could overrun the place. It's the last time Pete Carroll will ever play a game at the Coliseum, which I think has some special meaning to him. And there's just something special about the Seahawks this year. I do not see them stubbing their toe now, especially because, you know, whatever the outcome between the 49ers and the Saints, and we had the question about who should the Seahawks be rating, uh, rooting for, but once they see one of those two teams pick up loss number three, uh, that's going to be the, the uh, and, and also one of them pick up win number 11, that's going to be the little, the little goose in the ass of the uh, Seahawks to, to not stumble. Because if the Saints win, they got to win to stay pace with uh, New Orleans for the one seed. If the 49ers win, the Seahawks need that one to stay in pace with the 49ers atop the NFC West. So I think either way, the Seahawks know the stakes here. And I know the Rams are trying to climb back into it, but I don't think the Rams are good enough to get back into it this year. I think the Seahawks win 27-24 and uh, continue to move toward what very well could be that Seahawks 49ers week 17 primetime potentially winner take all one seed versus five seed matchup. Yeah. Um, Early in the week, I thought, ooh, this could be scary for the Seahawks. I, I mean, again, I, the Rams are – I really respect their toughness, their ability to battle. Uh, they did get the mojo going last week. I don't know if I could say it's realistic that they can do it that way again this week against the Seahawks. You know, Jadeveon Clowney, it sounds like he was feeling really good after the game, so he's going to be, you know, close to the 100% self-help there that way. I think, you know, the bootleg game scares me a little against Seattle because they could be way too aggressive at times. But I don't think the Rams' run game is good enough to complement the boot game, if that makes sense, to where it's as dangerous yet. And that's where it scares me. And then this is the other thing that scares me too, and this is where I, I go Seahawks. I'm going to pick them. But I think the other thing I look at is the Seahawks and this six offensive linemen set. The biggest weakness on the Rams' defense is they lack the size of some of the other really top-end football teams in the NFL. And we saw that with the Ravens. The Ravens just – they plowed them. They just said, we're bigger than you. Aaron Donald, you're a 285-pound D tackle. You're awesome. But if there's a weakness, you're not good against getting double-teamed when it's two 320-pounders pushing you. And the Seahawks got a lot of big <laughs> up front especially when they add George Fant as the tight end and go six offensive linemen. And sometimes they go a tight end with George Fant to where it's, you know, a two tight end look, but one of those tight ends is another tackle as in George Fant. And that is scary to me for the Rams in general. Uh, so I, I'm going Seahawks too. I, I, I think that the Rams can keep it close. I don't think it'll be a high-scoring game, but I just think the Seahawks are a little too big and physical for the Los Angeles Rams defense, and I think that pretty much goes for the same on the other side of the ball. I think the, the Seahawks defense is a little too big and physical for the Rams right now. I'm going Seahawks 20-17. to What did you pick the score to be? 27-24. 27-24. All right, so we're both on the Seahawks there. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.